hello guys and welcome back now today we'll be looking at how to use ads how to monetize your flutter app and we'll be using the unity ads in flutter okay so i've created just this simple one page app which is a stateful widget here and then we just have our text unity ads in flutter so let me just center this to be true okay and here we have it. All right, so this is the SDK, the plugin I'll be using. I've already installed it in my own app. Let me open my popspec.yaml file. Where is it? Popspec.yaml file. And you can see it here, the Unity ads. So what you just need to do is go to your unity dashboard or unity and here you just come here and create a project now you can give this a name i'll just call mine unity ads and what is this will this project be targeted to children under 13 no so create the project okay and here we have created the project so just come to monetization here and make sure it is on unity ads i have two projects here but just make sure yours is on unity ads and here just press enable ads okay All right, and let me try to reload this. While this reloads, let's come here. And after installing your Unity Ads plugin, you come to your Android folder here. Then inside your Android folder, you come under this app folder, and then you go inside and come to this build.gradle. And here you said the minimum SDK version to 19. It should be 16 there, but you said this to 19. Okay. So yeah, let's just enable the ads. All right. So do you want to use ad settings? No, I want a fresh start. And I use third party such as answers to serve ads to my multiple ads. So if you are using only Unity ads, you just come here. But I'll be using the third party mediation and third party and just use ad mob. I just come here and just use um not only Unity ads, okay? And here we should have our IDs. So the first thing you will do here is you initialize after changing this you initialize the unity add and you come into this stateful widget here under this state my app you have an override override sorry wrong spelling override init state and here under this super init you have unity adds dot initialize so this game ID here will be this. So if you're on Android, you copy this. If you're on iOS, you copy this. Copy to clipboard. And it will be a string. So you paste it and add your semicolon here. Now this is just saying that you should initialize the game Unity adds before the build method. And now in our body, we have the column, which will take the children property. And here we'll be using buttons first i'll show the elevated button the unpressed function we show our unity ads dot show video ad and here you can see we have three types of ad the interstitial ad rewarded and the banner ad so for the video ad you can use interstitial and rewarded I'll be using the interstitial first, so I'll copy that and 
in the placement i'll paste it here add your semicolon and the child will be a text which we say show interstitial add okay then we have another elevated button with an unpressed function here to unity add dot show video add here you copy your rewarded id ctrl v and the text will be show rewarded add text show rewarded add and the last thing we'll be adding here is just our unity banner add banner add and just copy the placement because i'm on android so i'm using the android placement okay so this is just it as simple as this now we restart our app let's wait for this to restart i see the unity ads is loading okay and this is it here we should have banner ads here but because my network is slow it does not load on time but once we click this button you should get our interstitial ad as i said my network is not fast but let's wait a few seconds for it to load up and show okay and here it is our video ad our rewarded ad and here you can just close it also to show your interstitia all right interstitia has not loaded yet let me see it hasn't loaded yet so if you have a faster network you should see your banner ad right here okay and this is our interstitial ad let's just wait for this you can skip this and close it so this is just how you monetize your app this rewarded ads you can just show it and for a game just if they're out of coin you can just show it so that you can add more coin to it instead of buying and this interstitial ad and the banner ads like that you get money once it view your ads and this is where we'll be stopping today kindly subscribe to my youtube channel if you haven't also like this video comment down the type of video you want in the next class and i will see you then